I am more than just a driver, you know. I'm someone's hope, I'm someone's help, I'm someone's salvation or I'm someone's story of survival. Many of the times we we actually are the first contact point and usually you're there to pick them up after this ordeal because you bring them in and then you take them back home. So you get to see the transformation of what the services have been have done for the person. Most of the time they are crying, they are hysterical. He did a psychological first aid training. So it helps you calm them, calm them down and you ensure that you assure them that they're going to be a safe place, they're going to get help. Sometimes you get people that come into the car and they can't even talk. You know, they're not comfortable, they are not because you're most of the time they've been assaulted by a man. And for them to be picked up by a man who even opens the door for them, gets them in the car, you know. So I was called to go pick up a client who had been assaulted while she was walking back from school. So I could only imagine how I would feel had my daughter been the one who was assaulted. Because you just open the door, someone gets out of the car and they just give you a hug and they say thank you. And it's I think that that thank you and how warm and deep it is and how heartfelt it is, those are the biggest words.